Hi everyone, my name is Aman Praveen and I am a second year medical college student in SMMC India. If you are new here, welcome. And if you are already a subscriber and you know me, welcome back. Today we will be discussing about the coronary sinus. The coronary sinus basically drains the venous blood of the heart and it is one of the most important structures and uh, all the veins present in the heart drains into the venous sac called as the coronary sinus there are a few exceptions though firstly the size of the coronary sinus it is approximately 3 cm long and is uh, located in the posterior coronary sulcus the posterior coronary sulcus is otherwise known as the atrioventricular group and embryologically the coronary sinus actually comes from the uh, is actually a remnant of the left horn of the sinus venosus and this coronary sinus opens into the smooth posterior wall of the right atrium uh, it is present posteriorly as you know opens into the smooth part of the posterior wall okay so now let's see the tributaries that's uh, really important right the main problem about uh, studying the heart and the venous drainage is that during our dissection uh, what they do is the, they turn the heart and show it from the posterior aspect so what happens is that the left becomes the right hand side and the right becomes the left hand side so it sort of becomes hard to um, picturize in the mind uh, so I would mainly prefer you to view the heart from the anterior uh, way uh, which will help you to correlate with all the arteries which are also you know taking part firstly let's see the um, uh, great cardiac vein the great cardiac vein is the largest tributary of the uh, of the uh, coronary sinus so for it, it is present in the anterior surface and then winds around and goes to the posterior aspect and drains into the coronary sinus in the anterior view you see this place this place what does it run I mean what artery does run over here the LAD left anterior descending artery runs over here and it continues as the circumflex artery right this is the circumflex artery now let's go to the uh, small cardiac vein the small cardiac vein goes along the inferior border and then winds and goes to the I mean goes to the posterior surface and then uh, drains into the coronary sinus as you know in the anterior aspect what is there the right marginal artery is actually present over here and from here comes the uh, right coronary artery which goes posteriorly it goes like this okay and then we have the middle cardiac vein which is present in the posterior aspect and uh, drains into the coronary sinus and then there are uh, certain veins which aren't present in any groove and all such as the posterior vein of the left ventricle and the oblique vein of the left atrium which is otherwise known as the vein of Marshall it is an important MCQ question uh, what is the vein, vein of Marshall that is the oblique vein of the left atrium okay okay these are all fine right these are all fine uh, now let's see the exceptions we see that all these veins all these veins are draining into the uh, coronary sinus right there are some veins which do not actually those are the anterior cardiac veins which are present in the anterior aspect which are present in the anterior aspect and drain into the anterior wall into the anterior wall of the atrium it is not a tributary of the coronary sinus but is a part of the uh, venous drainage system of the heart so yeah this is about the venous drainage of the heart and I hope this diagram 
I hope that this diagram uh, helped you a lot to understand because all the images or diagrams depicted in our textbooks aren't uh, the most easiest to understand I believe and um, if this video was really useful for you make sure to share it with your friends share the knowledge it's really important I believe and uh, make sure to click the like button and uh, if you have any doubts or you feel like appreciating or have any issues let me know in the comment section and if you haven't subscribed yet kindly do subscribe because I'll be posting a lot of important concepts and a few fun stuff here and there so thanks for watching and as always be awesome